I think people get the differences between a psychiatrist, a psychologist, and a counselor confused. So here are some of the major differences. A psychiatrist is a medical doctor. For the most part, their practices deal essentially with prescribing and then monitoring medications. Counselors have a master's degree in psychology or a related field. Psychologists have a doctorate in psychology. So my doctorate is in clinical psychology. I've had eight years of training in both the assessment and intervention of children and adolescents with a specialty in um, the emotional and behavioral problems that they present when they come in. You distinguish adolescent therapy from adult therapy in large part on what the developmental differences are and what the developmental task is for that age group. And that is, who am I? How do I fit into this world? When parents are debating whether or not to bring their kids in for therapy, the first piece of advice that I have for them is to sit down and spend some time talking with their child about what therapy means to them. My first session is always a consultation that doesn't cost anything, and so I, I want to use that time to um, really get across what it is that I do, but really, more importantly, to get an idea of how the child perceives his or her problems. Um, and what it is he or her wants out of treatment. What are his or her goals? I think it's really important to help adolescents understand who it is that they are and how best to fit in with other people. That's what makes those crazy years from 12 to 19 or 12 to 20 so critical. And so if I can help them get a greater understanding of that, developmentally speaking, then I'm doing my job.